Hello everybody. So today I want to talk about calculus, the topic that is about integration. So now I want to show you how to answer. They want to find f of t and the value of 8 in here. So now I want to show you how to answer. The first thing we need to do first derivative for the both sides. So this one that is about the constant. So you got number zero. So if we do this integration in here, we need to do about first the derivative of s and the value of s we change for t minus we need to do first the first derivative of 8 the value of 8 we change for t this one we have negative number 2 s to the power of negative number 3 so we know that this one that is about the constant so when we do first derivative of 8 you got number 0 so this one in here we have number 0 this one that is about number 1 and now we can put like this So this one we have negative number 6, s to the power of negative number 3. Later that we multiply both sides by s to the power of 4. And now we have like this. And we know that they want to find f of t. So f of t they should be like this. After we have this one, we go back to this integration so we put f of t equal to negative 60 gone here so this one we have negative number 6 t to the power of negative number 3 because we simplify this one and you got like this now if we do this integration we will have negative number 6 s to the power of negative number 2 over negative number 2 and we put the bounds from a to s because we put negative number 3 plus 1, we have negative number 2. And now we have like this. Negative number 6 divided by negative number 2, we have positive number 3. This one, we put S cone here. This one, I will put 8 cone here. Now we simplify this one and this one for the both side. This one I will put on the right. And now we divide both sides by number 3. And now we can find the value of 8. That is about positive or negative the square root of 3 over 2. This is the end. Thank you for watching.